Hello Aries, this is Mystic Goddess with your general reading. So today we're going to tap into the deepest, most guarded secrets when it comes to the person you are currently dealing with in love or thinking about. Cross watchers, do keep in mind that the energies can be reversed. So if you are a cross watcher, this could definitely be the deepest, most guarded secrets of the person that you are dealing with in love or thinking about. All right, so Aries, and or cross watchers i've meditated over the energy and i've shuffled the deck so let's go ahead and get started the overall energy of the deepest secret that this person is currently hiding is i want you all to myself okay this is a direct message to you from this person's energy it's an important message that you need to know so they want you all to themselves this person does not want to see you with anyone else they're very possessive when it comes to you this person has a desire to own or dominate over you this person is also stating that they miss you a lot, okay? But I feel as though this is someone that has a tendency to deal with sneaky links or be involved with secret lovers. I feel like they do this when they're under the influence of drugs or alcohol or either drugs and alcohol may influence this person to, um, to possibly link up with people on the down low. All right. I also do feel as though for some of you, this person um, is a sweet talker. They're a manipulator, a charmer. OK, for some of you, this person may be going through some type of legal issue. This could be traffic violations. This could also be anything dealing with the court system, whether it's child support or anything like that. OK, this person may go through some type of legal issue. They're also stating that you're not going anywhere. OK, so it just goes to show how possessive this person is over you they also regret or they're remorseful in regards to being fearful of giving you a commitment this person is very lusty as well they have a lot of passion for you and there is a very deep physical or sexual attraction or desire that they have for you all right so we're gonna see what else comes out i'm gonna be using our mystic goddess confessions deck this deck is currently sold out but for those of you that have ordered you will be receiving your decks next week week okay all right so let's go ahead and get into it holy spirit please give me more messages please in regards to this person's deepest most guarded secrets that aries and or any cross watchers need to know about what is this person's deepest secrets or most guarded secrets that aries and or any cross watchers need to know about currently all right two more shuffles for some of you i feel like this person is a headache because it's almost like i'm starting to get a little bit of a headache so they may be a headache this person may have given you like anxiety or like they may have ran your blood pressure up or this person may suffer from headaches or something of that nature all right so at the bottom of the deck we have a selfish okay self-absorbed and very egotistical so this person's very selfish which makes a lot of sense with i want you all to myself being here this person only cares about their own um desires okay i do feel as though for some of you this person has admitted to someone that they mess things up with you because we do have this energetic message stating i'm sorry i know i've messed things up for some of you this person has spread rumors or gossip they may be talking to other people or discussing information about you that may or may not be true now for some of you this person there's some gossip going around that they may have some type of sexually transmitted disease or they may have talked to someone in regards to some type of symptoms that they're experiencing or they may fear that they've been exposed to some type of std okay this person also is stating that they love you okay and they would like to have a child with you this person they do want to be a family with you okay so this person could either want a child with you you could have children with them or they may want to be with you or like have a family let's see what else comes out all right give me more give me more holy spirit in regards to thank you 
All right, so we have I'm addicted to having sex with you. This is another energetic message this person wants you to know. So if you've been intimate with this person, they're addicted to the sex with you. If you haven't been intimate with this person, they feel as though if the two of you were to be sexual together, okay, that they would become addicted. This is also like a fatal attraction type of energy. They have and if I can't have you, no one can mentality. So if you've had sex with this person, like they is, they have this very obsessive energy over you and I don't like it. It's a little too obsessive, okay? Now, if you haven't been intimate with them, if you were to be intimate, this is the type of energy this person would be in, okay? Ooh. For some of you, this person may have low self-esteem. They may be insecure because they're needing money. For some of you, this person is definitely a gold digger. They're the type that engage in relationships for money instead of love. This person is also very possessive. They may be even stingy in regards to their money. Okay, for others of you, this person just has a desire to own or dominate you. So they're very possessive when it comes to you. Give me more. Thank you. So we have two that came out. We have appearing nonchalant pretending to be unbothered and we also have sweet talker manipulator charmer so i feel as though this person they appear to be unbothered by you like they're going on with their life like they're just living and not uh, paying you any attention when in reality that couldn't be the furthest from the truth this person also has a tendency to sweet talk okay they're very good with words they're a huge manipulator they're very good at charming people all right so yeah this person is pretending that you're not the goat when in reality you really are because we have this energetic message to them from you stating you're the greatest of them all no one else compares to you all right so this person doesn't want you to know that you're the best they've ever had or you're the best relationship they ever had okay this is the type of person that's a free agent they have an i do what i want when i want mentality oh for some of you this person has a sex addiction okay or some type of porn addiction this is the type of person that would try to trap you with a child so for some of you if you're able to have children this person would try to intentionally have a child with you okay if you are not able to have children then this person would they're the type that um would try to trap you with sex okay they're very lusty very passionate when it comes to you give me more holy spirit in regards to thank you so we have watching stalking or spying so this person spying on you they're trying to see if you have received a serious love offer from anyone else or if you have decided to settle down with another person for some of you i feel as though this person wants to settle down with you but they wear a mask but it's all a facade they don't show you their true self okay for some of you, this person feels as though you are their twin flame. For some of you, this could be your twin, okay? But this person is the type that deals with friends with benefits. They're the type that um, you may even feel as though they only wanted you for sex or that they were dealing with people on the side for sex, okay? So some of you decided to move on from this person or you are wanting to move on. You're wanting to start something new with someone else, okay? I do also feel as though for some of you, this person intentionally holds back from you. They don't put in a lot, a lot of effort or they wait for you to take action. Now, for some of you, you may be intentionally holding back from this person because you've decided to move on or you're wanting to. I do see that um, there is a karmic in this person's life that may end up resulting in this person doing some type of jail time in the future, okay? But they're saying even though they're involved with the karmic, okay that they're not going anywhere i do also feel this person has um fake or jealous friends or family members that influence them in regards to whether they should reconcile or try to recover the bond that they have with you so they're easily influenced by the people around them okay but regardless they're stating that they still love you all right give me more spirit what else what else needs to be exposed okay so regret remorseful this person is regretting being selfish okay they know that they're egotistical they know that they're self-absorbed okay and this is someone that they regret being that way they didn't give you what it is that you deserve they didn't either they didn't reciprocate your energy or they only cared about themselves okay this is someone that did not put your feelings 
or make your feelings a priority or for some of you they didn't even make you a priority okay but they still wanted you all to themselves because they're selfish what else spirit give me more okay so we have sneaky link again involved with a secret lover and drug or alcohol addiction so for some of you this person is dealing with secret lovers okay they also have some type of drug or alcohol addiction for some of you when they're under the influence you wouldn't even know because that came out under appearing nonchalant so it's almost like they may use some type of drug or alcohol um and like for some of you you wouldn't even know they're under the influence or this person makes it appear as though like um like they're not using drugs or alcohol regardless this person is very unfaithful and they're a cheater okay they do feel as though you are their soulmate and they're very obsessed or infatuated with you mm, this person has a lot of issues give me one more message holy spirit thank you all right so we have making contact expect an incoming call text or email for some of you you block this person for others of you this person wants to reach out to you so you can expect an incoming call text or email from them but keep in mind that when this person reaches out to you they may be trying to manipulate or charm you this is the type of person that has low self-esteem they're very insecure okay for some of you they want to contact you but they feel insecure about it for some keep in mind this person may need money so um that may be why they're reaching out for others of you i feel as though see it's still coming out with this gold digger energy this is someone that could possibly be a gold digger or they deal with people that are gold diggers take it however it resonates all right so aries and or cross watchers that is your reading if you guys resonated with this or if you like this type of reading make sure that you give this video a thumbs up also don't forget to, sus to subscribe if you haven't already i would love to have you as a part of the mystic family and don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you'll receive an alert whenever i post messages from spirit to you i love each and every one of you guys so so much you take care be safe until next time bye